Hello. How you doing? Can you hear me? Can you hear me okay? Hello. Hello, 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 students. Welcome to our English session. Can you hear me? Hello. Hello, teacher. Hi, teacher Kalev here. Who's there? Um, Marlo. Hi, Marlo. Hi, Marlon. How are you today? Uh, my day, um, so so. And how are you today? Should it, your day? Very busy, man. Very busy. It was a very, very active and productive day. Thank you for asking. Mm. Hello, Oscar. Very how good. are you? Hello? Oscar, Oscar, are you there? Okay. We only have two students tonight. Wow. Where are my students? That's a good question, huh? Can you hear me, Oscar Cruz? Maybe you don't have access to your microphone. Oh, he doesn't even have the earphones. Oh, my goodness. Okay, okay, okay. So, practically, um, we're going to wait a little for your classmates. In the meantime, in the meantime, tell me about you. Tell me something about you. Tell me something new, Marlon. Anything new with you? Marlon. Hey, mm -hmm. Hello, repeat, please. Paul. Tell us anything about you. Uh, fíjese que ayer no estuve en clase y la verdad es que me, me he descontinuado un poquito. ¿Me podría explicar? Repeat, please. Eh, ayer no pude asistir a clase porque se fue la luz. Mm -hmm. Entonces, mm -hmm. ¿me podría explicar? Porque esta luz, no, no me, no me acuerdo qué es. Tell es decir, y, y us es nosotros. Tell us. Es como cuando tú dices tell me, ¿verdad? Dime a mí. Tell you es decirte a ti. Ajá, sí. Tell, no. tell her a ella, tell, tell him a él, y así todos los pronouns. Ok. Entonces yo te dije, tell us, cuéntanos, dinos. Right? Or what? Algo de ti, something about you. Um, I, I am 20 years, I am 20 years, 25, no, 28 years old. Uh, I bachelor degree in merchandise international. Oh, nice. Uh, yeah. Um, mm, I working in the Diana. Um, uh, oh. It, Y que, and I I study English with with teacher. Se me dio su nombre. Nice to meet you. I'm your teacher, Kalel Duñez, in this module. Sorry, teacher. <laughs> hey, I'm not, I'm not stingy, bro. I'm not stingy. Okay. I'm glad. I'm glad. You sound like a very successful man. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh, uh, tell me, sería, ¿cómo sería? Eh, cuénteme sobre usted. Sería, tell me for about, you. Or, about. Tell me about you. Correct, ¿Sí? correct, correct. Repeat again with intonation. Tell me. Tell me about you. Tell me, tell me. Así la, like, como que lo vas a introducir. So, teacher. Y me haces la pregunta. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, so, teacher, tell me about you. There you go. There you go. That sounds natural. I like it. 
Uh, very well, man. Very well. Um, I have my um, teacher's degree, and right now I'm working on my uh, licensure. Then I'm going to travel to the United States maybe in one or two years because I want to get my master's degree over there in the States. You understand? Yeah. Uh, you go to uh, the United or, or I study in, in... It's my plan. Yeah. It's my future ah, okay. plan. Ah, okay. Okay, okay. Welcome, everyone. Welcome. Welcome. Come on in. How you doing? Good to see you. Are we ready? Are we ready? Yeah, Woo! Sound clear now. Sounds clear, it is. Hi. Ah, uh, it's because now you are at home, correct? Yeah. <laughs> you are using your residential internet connection. Yeah, it's very good. But in my world, uh, it's bad. It's bad because you're using your 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 cell phone, your your mobile, your mobile yeah. data. Huh? It pays the my my datos. I don't know say datos. Mobile data. Mobile data. Mobile. Mobile data. Da data. Data. Is D A T A. Oh. Mobile like 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 cell phone, right? Yeah. Mobile data. Mm-hmm. Okay. Hello, hello. How's it going? How's it going? How's everything? Hmm? Anything new? Anything new or no? Nothing new? What's up? Say hello. People, are you there? Teacher, I have problems my internet with my internet because it is raining. Really? Where are you? It is. I'm sorry, Ingrid. Where are you? Where is that? Is it here in San Salvador? Is it raining where you are, guys? It is. It is? All right. All right. All right. Okay. 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 So let's start with the class. Let me tell you, I am very happy that we have covered all the content uh, that this um, this module has, right? So what the we're going to... Upstairs. Really? Can you hear me? Se cayó el profe. <laughs> Se cayó. Ay, vino ya nuevo. Hello. Welcome back. <laughs> Your microphone, teacher. Hey, what's going on here? Okay, I'm going to block my camera now because I think I'm having some internet connections. Uh, internet issues, I'm sorry. Let me see. I'm going to report this right now. Is it raining where you are, guys? It's starting to rain here. In San Jacinto, no raining, teacher. It's not raining. No raining. One second, please. One second. Let me report this. Raining. Okay. Very well. I already reported it, guys. I'm sorry. I'm not going to have my camera activated today. Um, I'm having some internet connections. So as I was telling you, we finished the content. So I am very happy that we are able to have conversation practice because our skill or the most important skill is your speaking skill. Anyways, uh, we're going to try to cover it as as much as possible we're going to go back we're going to retouch some uh, topics that we saw before and we're going to have conversations practice okay the final day the final day we're going to have an exposition an individual exposition but i'm gonna explain that to you later okay 
first we're going to share our screen i believe you might remember this topic so since we already saw this topic right since we already saw this topic you are already familiarized with it okay so we're going to have a conversation based on this i want you to see the structure i want you to take your notes up and I want you to try to participate as much as you can. Also, I'm going to ask you, if you have noise in your place, let us know. Or you're going to have your microphone off. Okay? If you have a quiet place, then you can feel free to participate. If you have noise, you can chat. Remember, you can chat the, the answer also on that option okay so what we're going to do wait we have a chat uh i'm gonna report this i already reported okay so what we're going to do we're going to have a conversation now okay guys can you make a question I'm going to start up with a question. Did you used to collect things? I'm going to change this question and you're going to give your answer, okay? Later, we might use this formula, but I'm going to open up with this question, guys. Uh, did you used to did you used to be hyperactive when you were a child? Do you know what is hyperactive? Yes, teacher. Okay. What about you? Yes, I used to be. Used to be. Not but anymore? No, no, nowadays I can I'm kind of quiet. <laughs> when I was a when I was a child, I remember that my the teachers teachers used to call my mother to uh, uh, I don't know how to say poner queja, teacher. To, to, to make a complaint about to you. To make a complaint about me. Ouch. Because I used to be very... Troublemaker. Uh, troublemaker, yes. <laughs> okay, Mr. Jose, good job. Make a question using did you used to use your creativity. Okay. Um, it's for the class. Ah. Oh. Uh, did you used to be a smart student when you were a child? Mm -hmm. That's a good one. Any volunteer, raise your hand or chat your answer. <laughs> a smart student. Did you used to be a smart student? Boys are, are used to be more intelligent than girls. I don't know. <laughs> Correct me if I'm mistaken. No. Correct. It's not true. No. Little depends. girls are, are more intelligent than than boys. Yeah. More applicated, huh? Okay, I, I remake my question, teacher. Okay. Who, okay, for the whole class, who do you think is is smarter who used to be smarter boys or girls of course boys boys right boys used to be say it say it yes boys used to be smarter <laughs> boys used to be smarter is that right no, for reals. I remember in my class when I was a child, there was a boy named Raul. Wow, he got 10 in everything. 
He used to be very smart, but very smart. I mean it. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Michelle, can you make a question using did you used to dance when you were a kid? Did you used to collect things? Did you used to go to parties when you were a teenager? I don't know. Something like that. Did, did you used to fly biscuitas when you were a... Uh, I'm sorry. See, sí, no. <laughs> yeah, did you used to fly kites? Uh-huh. Repeat. Uh, did you just, did you used to fly? What, what is the word? Kites is K-I-T-E-S. Kite. Kite. Uh -huh. Kites. 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 Oh, I did. I used to fly kites. What about you guys? My case, I didn't. You I didn't? Why. No, because I think so. My grandma didn't, uh, I don't have to say it, but she thinks that kind of things is only for boys. You know? Boys games. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. And she, she was just like, why are you going to fly a kite? You are a girl. And I was just like, uh, yeah. funny. but I, I never did it. So I saw the other It's, it's very fun. It's very I fun. Think, uh, yeah. So. Especially when you do, when you do it at the beach, right? With, because it's very windy. There. Uh, mm -hmm. Feels good. What about you guys? Did you, did you used to do something like that? No, I never did it, teacher. You never did it? Never. Mm, this because you are from the new generation, Jose. You are, you know, the generation of the cell phones, technology, apps here, apps there. Yeah. Yeah. I used to play Game Boy Color, teacher. That's ah. it. That's it. That's it. I'm, that's what I'm saying. You're very young. You're from the new generation. We are from the, maybe me, I am from the old generation, from the 80s, you know? Ah. So we, we didn't have internet at that moment. So we used to play with kites, right? Marbles. You know what is marbles? Like Captain Marble? <laughs> like Chivolas, marbles. Ah. Yeah. Okay, let's make a question. Iris, can you make a question using did you used to? Open up your, it, yeah. Teacher, it did say uh, the marble. I went to the chair and remember and I, I didn't play the marble, my <laughs> my brothers, because I the I the girl. Same scenario than Michelle, huh? Yeah. Times two, Michelle. Times two. Yeah, no. But it happened. My brother is bad for me. You know, back in the day, parents were very traditional, right? I so yeah. No, thank you. In the, in the moment, I know. Ah, I went to the, I don't know, enseñar a my, my son. Teach. I did teach I my son because I know I didn't aim, play. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Make another question. It is for the class. Did you used to? <sighs> did you, did you do? No, did you used to? Did you do? do? Did you, did you used to? Do? Used to. Mm -hmm. Did you just do the mm -hmm. play the? Wait, let's correct that pronunciation. Are you looking at the? Uh, are you looking at the screen? Did you do? No. Did you use to collect did things? Did you, did you use to use go to the um, stadium? Did you use to play with other? Friends, I don't know. Did you do to play the? Um, I don't know. Say um. I don't know how to lolo. say. I don't know how to say. I don't know how you say um lodo, tortilla de lodo. Mud, <laughs> mud. Mud. Yeah. Try to use a dictionary, it is, so you can look for vocabulary. 
Yeah. Yes, teacher. Add the use in the okay, moment. very good. Remember that. Remember, guys, that you are intermediate students, right? Yeah. You're not you're not basic anymore. So you have to change that chip of of depending too much on your teacher, right? You have to look yeah. for your information too. And what you can do at this level is that you look for one word in the dictionary, like like in this case, mud. You look in the dictionary, lolo in Spanish, right? It's gonna get you mud. Uh, so you having that word, you're going to ask your teacher, hey teacher, can we check this word? Mud is a spell, M-U-D. So you check the question with the teacher, right? Instead of you asking teacher, how do you say this? How do you say that? Because you are intermediate students. So you have to be more like, more like, how can I say this? You have to be more aggressive on your on your progress. Yeah, you want to have you want to know how to say something that, you know, in English, go to your dictionary and you have it in your cell phone. It's very easy. Right. So do it, guys. Have that attitude. That That's a very good attitude. It's a recommendation for intermediate students. Mm -hmm. All right. My pleasure. Okay, Noemi, you have a question, right? I'm sorry. Okay, teacher. Did you used to play basketball in your college? Ooh, that's a nice one. Raise your hand, please, or chat your answer. Good job, Noemi. Okay. Eh, Francisco pregunta si alguien puede ver lo que, lo que estoy proyectando. ¿Lo pueden ver o no? Sí, yo lo puedo ver. Yo me oh, salí okay. porque no me aparece yes, ese... Toledo Muñoz ha empezado la función compartir las pantallas, solo eso me aparece. Ah, pues, you have internet problems. Okay. But I can I, I cannot neither, teacher. You say, I can't either. I can't either. Sorry. Really? Really? Let me, yes, let me but... try again. Mm -hmm. Let me try again. Thank you, Francisco. Thank you for reporting. Okay, same teacher. Yeah, I'm sorry. Why? Don't be sorry, man. Be happy. Yeah. Okay, yeah, puedo verlo. <laughs> no, I can't, teacher. Thank you. All right. All right. Thank you. Thank you. You're very kind. Okay, so let me go back to... Okay, there you go. So now what I need is to get your faces out of here and put them on the next um, monitor that I have. It, do you still see it very well? Do you still see it? Can you see it? Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Okay, uh, Michelle, do you have something for us? Yes, another question. Cool, go for it. Did you still go to Quinceañeras? I <laughs> did you used to be a chambelan right uh -huh, guys someone no i didn't used to do it used to go you were shy no, but why but, but i, I mean, remember i i went you i went shy. once i remember i i went once and in and it was boring teacher boring Yes, because you were everything. a kid. You wanted to play, uh, man. I don't know. The, the whole <laughs> people was dancing and and I missed my my video games. <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing. You were just a little kid thinking about uh, video I, games. Right? Because they are really funny quinceañeras party, I think so. And you, and you used to be like, like uh, Michelle, you used to be the one, like the one that goes with the quinceañera, right? Uh, with the long dresses and, and, and dancing, you know, balls and everything. Short dress. Nah, just kidding. Oh, <laughs> really? Okay. No, but I just go maybe three times, I think so. I, I When I was a teenager, I don't have a lot of friends. I mean, girls. I, think I, so. I didn't have. I didn't have. Mm -hmm. And Jose, all the people wear, all the people wear, what did you say? All the people wear what? We're dancing. Okay, 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 cool. And so it's plural, right? All the people wear dancing, okay? 
Be careful right there. Let's make another question. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Francisco, can you make one question using did you used to? Uh, the, the, the use, the used to. Uh, did, did you used to? Did they used to play video game in Johnny? Did you used to play video games, guys? Yeah, of course, Why? right? What is yes, your I used to game? What about the girls? What about the girls? Of Michelle? course. Oh, Why really? Not? What game? Yeah. What game, Mortal for example? Mortal Kombat, Mortal Kombat. Oh! <laughs> Mortal Kombat. Yeah. What else? Halo, what else? Halo, Crash Bandicoot. You, do you know Crash? Yeah. <laughs> I love Crash. That's my favorite. Interesting, interesting. Moral I'm combat. Play in, um, I was uh, a little kid. <laughs> Sorry, uh, you didn't play me in um, uh, uh, Mario Bros. Um, yeah. Killer Instinct. Killer Mouse Blue. I love um, that one. <laughs> okay, okay. Let's stop it. Let's stop it. Otherwise, okay. we're going to spend all the class over there. Okay. So, interesting question. Thank you, Francisco. Now, let me see, let me see, let me see. Let's make a WH word question. Use a WH word, did, subject, use to, verb in the present and the complement. Let's watch an example so you can have an idea. Always D, the auxiliary verb. We're making questions to each other, so we're gonna use you, the expression used to, right? Collect things. That's a yes, no question, the ones which is practice. That's a yes, no question. We're gonna work now on WH word question. For example, what sports did you use to play? What sports, right? It's, it's, it requires more information. So let's work on that. Let me see, does it, does it show it? Okay, there it goes. Okay, yeah, so those are just no questions. So for a WH word question, you, you use the WH word, right? And following the formula right there. So I'm going to open up this second part of the conversation and I'm going to ask you I'm going to ask you who did you use to play with when you were a child or a teenager? Who did you used to play with? If you remember if you go back to that to those files back there in the past. <laughs> I remember my best friend's name. Raise hands, virtual hands, or chat your answer. Go ahead. Intermediates, go ahead. Okay, let me change the question then. Um, what food did you used to like the most when you were a kid? Raise your hand or chat your answer. I, I just, uh, yeah, I just like pizza. pizza so push. much. Oh, pizza. okay. Yeah. Oh, daddy, take me to the pizza push. Take me, take me. Uh, uh, yeah. What about you, Jose? I used to like junk food, teacher. Junk food? Yes, pizzas, hamburgers, french fries. Uh, but nowadays, I don't like it anymore. I can, I can, I can, I can, I can see you like, I can imagine you like, Asking for your hamburger, right? Mom, yeah. try, bring me your, bring me my hamburger. Yeah, right? Kids really love junk food, like 
hamburgers, French fries, and stuff like that. And my mother used to get mad at me because she said that I needed to eat vegetables and and soups and, and soups and <laughs> everything like that. But I always was looking for junk food. Good job. Good job. Thank you, guys. Try to raise your hand or send your chat. Thank you for your chats. I have some chats right here. Let me check. Let me check them. It starts with Karen. It says, no, it says Jennifer. It says, did you used to play tennis with your family? Is correct question. Oh, she sent a uh, WH. What kind of music did you used to dance with your boyfriend? Aha, uh -huh, ladies, what about that? What kind of music did you used to dance with your boyfriend? Aha, uh -huh, any volunteer? Whatever. Really? Whatever music. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so you, you say it completely like I used to I used to dance everything, right? I used to dance everything, all kind of music. <laughs> Let me see. Jocelyn says, did you used to play guitar? It's did you used to play the guitar? Yeah. Did you used to play the guitar when you were a kid? When you were a kid, okay, Jocelyn? pass of B. Dina says, did you used to play soccer in 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 the street? In the street, in the street. Um, yeah, in the street. You missed the article. The street. In in preposition in your neighborhood. What movie did you is incomplete, Marlon? What movie did you used to watch? Yeah, sorry, yes, the reading uh the script. Oh, it got stuck. It got stuck when you were texting. Okay, what music did you used to listen to? Just put the preposition there, Dina, to. What preposition did you use to listen to? Good job. Francisco says, what game did you use to play when you went to a school? Okay, so lo que el verbo use lo vamos a poner en su forma base. Ahí lo hemos puesto en pasado. Y recuerda que estamos usando un auxiliary verb did. No, sé, no, no worries. Solo tomamos nota ahí. Okay. What kind of books did you used to read? Jocelyn, good job. Jocelyn and Jenny Torres says, did you used to meet with your friend in the weekend? Mm -hmm. Okay. Interesting. Okay. So... We have some WH questions right here. Let's pick one of them. Let me see. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Okay, let's talk about Marlon's. What movie did you used to watch? Watch The, the Child? I, uh -huh. What movie did you used to watch? Um. I, I shark. Shrek? Shark. Shark. So completely, yeah. completely you would say, uh, I used to watch. I used to watch Shrek. Shrek so much, huh? Shrek. Okay, raise your hand or send your answer. It's interesting. I used to watch all Disney movies. <laughs> all the princesses, all the queens, all the... Uh, Tales, right? Nice. And Barbies, Barbies movie. That's Barbies a... movies. All right. All right. Nice, nice, nice. What about you, Eduardo? Go ahead. I used to watch The Lion King. The Lion King. Yeah, that's a good one. With kids, kids love those kind of movies. Thank you, Eduardo. Who else? I didn't have a, a a favorite one, but I used to watch scary movies, terror, scary uh, movies? science fiction. Uh, yeah. Yes, <laughs> it was kind of amazing to watch because uh, I don't know. It it feels like my my imagination was working. I don't know how to how to say it. Yeah, uh, I can I cannot get you. Science fiction, terror, uh, 
thrillers. <laughs> it was amazing. To it's true. It's true. Uh, I used to watch the Thundercats, but I'm talking not not about a movie, but cartoons. Mm -hmm. Hey, did you use someone? Any of you? Did you used to watch the Flintstones? Yes, I did, teacher. You do? I, I, okay, you did? Yes. Okay. That's old school for me. Did you? Did you, Michelle? No, I didn't. You didn't watch them? Oh, my goodness. Okay, yes. I'm old. That's why I'm old. <laughs> okay, can you send any question? Can you send any question? He says, what? Oh, it is just send it. What cartoon did you, did, what cartoon did you read? Mm, maybe, right? Maybe. Uh huh. You can read it. You can watch it. Okay. Yes. Jennifer, when did you used to visit your grandmother? Yeah, that was nice, huh? When did you used to visit your grandmother? That's an interesting question. Good job. Send your questions. Someone has a WH question right now? Or let me choose participants. What if we go with them? Um, let me see. Edith, Edith Guzman, are you there? Maybe she's not. Dina, are you able to participate? Maybe she isn't there. Um, Teacher. Yes. I used to candy. I used to Heidi. eat. I used to eat candy and Heidi. <laughs> candy? Oh, uh, I'm sorry. No, I used to she's watch. she's talking about the cartoons. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I misunderstood you. Yeah. So it's watch. Candy, right? The girl. And, yes. and the other one, Heidi. Heidi, yes. <laughs> I yeah. love it. Yeah, I remember that too. I remember that too. Naomi, do you have a, a WH word question for us? You see uh, this structure? What, what did you used to um, at the beach? Mm, what did you used to do? Do you used to do at the beach? Here's gonna be what, what did you did, did you used to used to do uh, uh, swimming in the beach swimming in the beach no 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 the question is what what did you did you used to used to do do a ver repeat everything what did you used to do swimming? Mm, 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 mm. Eso es la respuesta. Oh. Usted quiere preguntar qué es lo que solíamos hacer uh -huh. cuando íbamos a la playa. ¿Cómo se dice sí. hacer? Hacer. ¿Cómo se dice hacer? Mm. Ese es un verbo básico. That's a basic verb. A ver, guys, ¿cómo se dice hacer? Están las dos opciones. Do. do and make. Correct. Do and make. Study, guys. Do Study. and make. Yes. And make. En este caso, vamos a usar do. Right? Porque no es algo que vamos a hacer con nuestras manos. It's oh. activities, right? Action verb. Okay. Can you repeat the question? Uh, what did you used to uh, do? Do. What did you used to do? What did do? What did you used to do? In the beach. In the beach. You understand, Naomi? Yes. We're learning English, right? Very good. Very good. Thanks. So Naomi, Naomi says. What did you used to do in the beach when you were a in, kid? Uh -huh. Eduardo, in. do you have an answer, Eduardo? Do, do you remember when you were a little boy? What did you used to do in the beach? 
what did you choose to do in the beach? I don't remember. <laughs> it was long, long time ago, huh? Um, do the castle. Uh, you used to do karate? Like karate? No, no. He said Castillo castle. De arena. <laughs> I can't hear you well. What did he say? Castle. Sí, Castillo de arena. Oh, sand castles. Mm -hmm. You used to, ah, ahí que vamos a usar, do or make? Make. Make. Creo que sería make. Correct. You used to make sand castles. That's very fun, isn't it? <laughs> what about you, Jocelyn? Go ahead, Jocelyn Herrera, participation. I used to eat cocktails. Cocktails? Yes. Wow, like like uh, shells, cocktails, or shrimps, cocktails. Yeah, seafood is very delicious. All right, thank you for your questions, people. Thank you for the practice on this topic. I hope it was helpful for you to have a conversation based on this. We're going to move to the next topic. If we could cover it, oops, I think I did one extra click right here. One second. Tomorrow we don't have classes, by the way, okay? So we're gonna give you vacation tomorrow. Let me see, 113, okay, this is where we were. 114, so you should jump to Two. Okay. Let's see. I'm gonna just turn this off. And I'm gonna go to the grammar section right away. Let's see. Okay, so what we're going to do here is using the adverbs of quantity, okay? What are the adverbs of quantity if you forgot? Too many, fewer, more, and aren't or, or, or isn't, aren't or isn't enough. This is for count nouns. Again, too many, fewer, more, or aren't enough or isn't enough, okay? And for the non-count nouns, we use too much, too much, less, more, and only isn't enough, isn't enough. Oh yeah, isn't enough is for non-countable. Aren't enough is for countable nouns. Okay, so for example, there are too many cars, countable nouns, right? And there is too much traffic, uncountable nouns. So if we're talking about maybe problems or, or situations around our neighborhood, we could use the um, adverbs of quantity. Can you tell about your neighborhood? First, you can tell where do you live, right? And then you can tell us one example about your neighborhood. So we can imagine what's your neighborhood like, right? If you tell us, for example, in my neighborhood, um, there is a lot of uh, parking space, right? There is a lot of parking or there isn't enough parking or you can talk about the safety, how, how safe is your neighborhood or how dirty is your neighborhood, right? Um, what else? How private is your neighborhood? How far is your neighborhood from the capital? Yeah, um, let's see. Let's see, let me start by asking questions to any volunteers. Do we have any volunteers? Or I go directly with, let me see. Jennifer Torres, are you here? 
Chin Taurus. Yes, sir. Awesome, awesome. Can you tell us an idea, something using adverse of quantity about your neighborhood? Where do you live, Jennifer? I live in Cincinnati. Nice, nice. Hot city, huh? Okay, so tell us something about your neighborhood using adverse of quantity. Okay, um, I think it too many is countable. Countable. And mm -hmm. And too much is in control because, uh, for example, there is too much traffic is in control. Uh, pollution is in control. Transp public transportation is in control. Um, I think um, um, too many is for control now. And, and, and about your neighborhood, Jenny, can you tell me something good or something bad about your neighborhood? In Sonsonate? I think it's cool. It's cool. Why? Um, there, there isn't too much traffic. Oh. Um, and okay. Day. okay. What about rain? No rain, teacher. Okay, so you will say there isn't, right? There isn't any rain. Very good, very good, very good. I like it. Thank you, Jennifer. All right. It is. What about in your neighborhood? Miss Hernandez, are you there? Yes, teacher. He's here. Where do you live, it is? In San Marcos City, teacher. San Marcos City. Okay, can you tell us something good or bad about your neighborhood? But you gotta use your adverse of quantity. Um, in my uh, in my neighborhood, quantity is many cars. In my in my look look like this one. There are there are too many cars. Too many cars. Pronounce this cars. Cars. It's plural. Uh huh. Really. Mm -hmm. Yeah, in my neighborhood. So there isn't enough parking, huh? Yeah, is the 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 uh, I don't know say uh, cada quien tiene su espacio. Each person has a it's space, right? Parking. Yeah, this person the parking. Okay, okay, thank you for your participation. What about you, Eduardo Ortiz? Where do you live? I live in Sonsonate. You live in Sonso as well as Jennifer, huh? Okay, can you tell us something about your neighborhood? And about your city in general? In my neighborhood, there, are, there aren't many cars. There aren't many cars. Oh, yes. so there is, there is much or or many parking. Guys, um, many parking. Much or many parking. Much, much parking. That's correct. That's correct. Good job. Good job. Okay. What about in your case, Naomi? Um, Where do you live? In Santa Ana City. Mm -hmm. Tell us something about Santa Ana City. Uh, there should be forward cars, the neighbors is uh, Plato. Problem? For the problem, the parking. So there isn't enough parking, say? There, there isn't, isn't enough? There isn't enough parking. Yeah. So there are too many cars, huh? There are too many cars. Yes, there are too many cars. Should, you can use should. There should be, there should be fewer cars, yeah? 
There should be fewer there cars. Should, there should be fewer cars. My father, my father says, yeah, families, families should have, families should have fewer cars. Families, families there should. Families, there should be fewer cars. Families should have few, few, fewer cars. Yes, because some families have two, three, four, four cars, cars. You know, four cars. The father has it, a car. The mother has the, a car. Yes. The brother has a car. The, the sister son, has a car. The sister, yes. So everybody has a car now. So that creates uh, and that generates more traffic. And uh at the police uh, well the police can't do anything against that because it's yeah. it's it's not under control yes thank you naomi for your participation thank you teacher Liceo is not on is, is no longer in the class huh let me see. Okay, okay, okay. What about you, Michelle? Where do you live? Tell us something about it. Mm, I was I was living in Soyapango. In I think so. There are too many cars and microbuses, a lot. Mini buses, yeah. And microbuses, the other one. Yeah, the smaller ones. Yes, and there is I always think? a lot of traffic, huh? <laughs> All the time. All the time. Okay. So we need it, more streets. <laughs> I don't know. What about what about the people? Um, can you They're say an great. example? You They're see people. I, I mean, driving or just or the people in Soyapango. Yeah, the people in Soyapango like Soyapango's population. There is a lot of people. Uh, there there are. Week, there are a lot of people. On the weekends in Plaza Mundo, you saw a lot of people and you're like... You can see, you can see a lot of people, huh? You can see a lot of people in the food court, shopping. Yeah, the parking space, full. It's crazy. Yes, really crazy. But they are good people, I think. So. You think? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Who else? Francisco, what about you, Mr. Lemus? Uh, in San Jacinto. You live in San Jacinto? Yes, I live in San Jacinto. Uh huh. Or what is it San like? San Marcos. By San Marcos. By San Marcos, sorry. Uh huh. Tell me, tell me something about it. Um, well, traffic? I don't know if it's a problem. Tell me that. Mm, the traffic is very um, congestionado. Um, you're you're for... trying to use these. You're trying to use many, fewer, more, enough, or too much, or less, or more, or or isn't enough. That's your job. It's money. Uh, traffic is very um, difficult for. So, so there is there is too much. There is too much traffic. Yes. <laughs> uh, for uh, minibus, minibus uh, buses. Mini buses, uh, buses, buses, taxis, buses, Ubers. Yeah. No, no, no. Uh, delivery. For, no, for uh, buses, mini buses, for. ¿Cómo se dice ir peleando la villa? Fighting. 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 On the street. So I got a stream for, for um, sorry, sorry, no, 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 sé cómo decir las palabras ahorita. <laughs> okay, no problem, no problem, my friend. Tell no problem. me. <laughs> Tell me the meaning. It's all right. What about, let me see, what about someone else? Oscar, what about you, Oscar? Yeah. There is too much. Uh, I live in Milopango. There is too much? Uh, there is too much traffic. There is too much traffic in Milopango, huh? We need the traffic like, like Mexico. Like Mexico's traffic? Oh my goodness. We need 
It's I heavy. Like Mexico. So you know Mexico? You visited Mexico before? Yes. Are you Mexican? Uh, yes, I, 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 visited, I visited Mexico in... Oh. Mm, 100, mm -hmm. nine, 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 90 something, nine, huh? 95. <laughs> 1995. 1995. 1995. Yes. 1995. Yes. Oh, but, uh, but hey, question, question, Oscar. You are Salvadorian or Mexican? Mexico. No, no. You are Salvadorian or Mexican? Okay. Yes, I am Salvadorian. Oh, okay. You're Salvadorian. Eh, okay. No sé cómo se dice, pero allá circulaban un día los impares, otro día los pares. La... Oh, really? Y eso wow that's a nice technique for reducing the traffic huh yeah hey thank you for the information sir thank you for that okay excellent i'm very i'm very happy to hear about that guys uh, so pretty much we're talking about your neighborhood some problems that they have there what about water do you have any any problem with with the water in your neighborhood? There is there is much water in your place or or no? Or there isn't enough water in your neighborhood. There in isn't. Sepango, it's crazy. Some days you have water, some days you don't have water. So some Sundays there is, and there when it's Sunday, right? When it's Sunday and you have water that day, there there is a lot of water that day, or there is a little water that day. Little. A little yeah. water. Yeah. Wow. You have a lot of water uh, at the evening. In the evening. All right. All right. What about in your place, Jose? Go ahead. Here in my house, we don't have water issues, teacher. So there is much water. There is enough water for you. Yes. Well, uh, sometimes my mother used to tell me that in, in some parts of the day, mm -hmm. the water goes on. I don't know how to say. We don't what? have the service of uh -huh. water. But uh, I come, well, well, I get out early and I come home uh, very late. So mm -hmm. I cannot see the moments where we don't have water. When, okay. I come, when I go out and when I come, I always have water in my house. So you have never seen or you cannot recognize a cantaro. <laughs> you you no. don't know yes. what that is. Yes, I have used it, teacher. Ah, yes, because <laughs> for example, when when the mayor hall, la alcaldía, city the, hall, where the city hall uh, used to do some works in the on the streets uh, that they have to fix some parts of the street i don't know how to say it <laughs> some holes uh, the street. <laughs> they they stop uh, sending us water oh only when there is some uh, work going on right uh-huh some repairs and i remember uh, one time when when we didn't have water for a week so we had to go to my sister's house that she has and we have to to ask her for water uh-huh and 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 that that's when i used uh, the cantaro 
Yeah, the problem that I have in my neighborhood, guys, is that there isn't any bread. There isn't enough bread. So I don't see ladies uh, sending bread no more. You know what I mean? So I have. What is to... bread, teacher? Bread? Pan? Bread? Pan. Ah, oh, pan. Come on. <laughs> what you. You serious? No, I know what is bread, but it was he don't, kind of. You don't see a lot of panaderos. Yeah, you, you have superpowers. Uh, we know that you have superpowers, Jose. Excuse it me. Sounds, it sounds strange for me that, oh. that that was a problem for you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I know what you mean. I know what you mean. Hey, guys, thank you for making this class very entertained. You are now the stars, right? You are the ones who have to shine. You are the ones who have to participate. I'm gonna just ask you for a little more, more effort, right? To, to the rest of the classmates. Remember that the more you speak, the better you get. If you speak, I can correct you. So you can speak better. If you don't speak, then you don't speak English well. You know what I mean? And I'm here to help you, but I need to also push you. You know what I mean? I'm not like, like a very, um, you know, I'm funny and everything, right? But <laughs> I'm not the kind of teacher that is very slow or, or is not demanding. I am very demanding. I expect a lot from my students. And if you are connected in this class, it's because you, you are doing your best. So keep doing your best. Congratulations for having a great class and for your participation. See you until Monday. Happy long weekend, everyone. Bye-bye, teacher. Good See bye. you Monday, teacher. Be safe. Bye -bye, teacher. See you later. See you later, Have a good weekend. See you later. Bye. See you on Halloween. See you on Halloween. <laughs> Get ready for it. Bye-bye. Oh. Bye. Have a good weekend. Bye.